Well, today marks one year of COVID-19 vaccines being available to fight the disease that has killed more than 700,000 Americans. At that point in time, the United States with a proactive response to protecting people from the coronavirus. Fox 44's Jessica Rivera, she spoke with McLennan County Public Health on what this day means for them. Jessica. It's been a long year for everyone, and now the health district can say with all eligible groups, about 51% of McLennan County population is fully vaccinated. December 14th marks an important day, one year since the FDA approved the use of COVID-19 vaccine to protect the community from the coronavirus. <laughs> The Waco McLennan County Public Health District received its first shipment on December 23rd and began vaccinating first responders. Over 100,000 doses have been administered in McLennan County, not only by us as a health district, but by our vaccine partners, physicians' offices, uh, pharmacies, other providers, all offering the vaccine to help our community. Looking back when the FDA first approved the vaccines, McLennan County and other counties had some obstacles. Those first few months were, it was very difficult because we had a limited supply. If you look at today, we have plenty of vaccine. With the help of many partnerships, 51% of McLennan County residents ages five and up are fully vaccinated. Now we have mobile clinics, and so we'll come to you and we'll come to different areas in the county. And we've worked with all of the independent school districts to offer vaccines within their school district at the schools. Kelly Crane with the McLennan County Public Health District says they have seen an increase of demand for vaccines after hearing the news about the Delta and Omicron variant. And during that time, people were realizing, oh, wow, this is important. Now I'm seeing more and more people get sick. And so we actually had a lot of people decide, I need the vaccine. For those who are interested in getting the vaccine, we'll share with you on our website where you can find a vaccine location near you. In the studio, Jesse Garibera, Fox 44 News.